Micromax Canvas 4 has now replaced Micromax Canvas HD as Micromax's flagship phone. This is something that has got Ankit really excited. We'll get into more of his excitement and analysis of the <laughs> phone, but before that, we'll get into tech specs. Micromax had an event earlier this week and all eyes were set on what Micromax is going to astound us with now. Enter the hottie Chitranga Singh with Micromax's Rahul Sharma to unveil the star of the night. And yes, Micromax did it again. This time they pulled a Samsung Galaxy S4 at 17,400 only. It's called Micromax Canvas 4. While we know where that number came from, we don't know how they managed to pull off these stunts. But let's look at its tech specs. Micromax Canvas 4 runs Android's Jelly Bean with 1 GB of RAM. For storage, it has 16 GB of internal memory that can be expanded up to 32 GB. The fourth generation of Canvas smartphones, Canvas 4, has a 13 megapixel rear-facing camera and a robust 5 megapixel front-facing camera. You can record video at 1920 by 1080p at 30 fps. For connectivity, it has USB 3.0, GPRS, Edge, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 4.0. You know, Canvas HD really blew people's mind when it had launched and yeah. it went head on with Samsung's Galaxy Grand, which yeah. was launched then. And Canvas HD was so popular that they always had less supply yeah. and more demand yeah. for the phone. Which is always a good place to be. Which is incredible. Uh, and Canvas Four wants to build on that. Yeah. Um, firstly, there are a couple of things that Micromax should just stop doing. Okay. Okay, like the nomenclature, for example. It's a clear pot shot or it's a clear way to confuse people with Galaxy S4 or Canvas 4. Quit doing that, Micromax. You know, as a brand, you guys are at a position, at a stage where people know and respect and want you for who you are, not yeah. because you try to mimic or want to be a, you know, a you cheaper have, version of have, a more expensive phone. Yeah, you have brand equity of your own you now. You do. So yeah. don't dilute it by, you know, juvenile stuff like calling your phone Canvas phone. But having said that, this does look a lot like a Samsung phone. Come on, Ankit. It does. It does. I took it to the Samsung Galaxy S4 <laughs> yeah. Zoom launch and, yeah. you know, it helps that it does not have micro yeah. up front over here. Half a dozen people thought I'm carrying a Galaxy S4. Unless you look at it closely, then obviously there are telling signs, but you know, if one quick glance and you're like, wow, dude, S4, mmm. But Micromax has never really made any bones about the fact that, well, imitation can be the best form of flattery. It's ever. worked for them so far. It's a formula that has yeah. clearly worked for them so far. But this device clearly takes the Micromax canvas lineage to a whole new level. You know, you hold the device, it immediately feels extremely premium. Yeah. It does not feel like a typical canvas device, which is otherwise very plasticky, you know, a big broad bezels and yeah. stuff like that. The aluminum band over here gives it a super premium feel. Does not feel like an 18,000 rupee phone at all. Feels way more expensive. You know the things that I like about the phone, that's because I'm a really gimmicky person and I'm not a complete geek <laughs> like him. So I'm not getting into the hardware and all of that. What I like is the little gimmicks that you have. So, you know, if Samsung had air view and air gestures and all of that, what Micromax has is air kissing. I like to call oh, it air kissing. Dude. So what you can do to unlock your screen is just sort of air kiss. Really and your that screen gets unlocked. I get very excited about that. It's like pouch and your phone uh, phone screen unlocks. You can flip it. You know, you can flip it and it goes on mute. You can hold the phone to your ear like this and take your call. And for me, this is like my version of a science fiction film. Really, Fair enough. you know, it's like it's it, it's my version of a science fiction film. You know, as a geek, of course, everybody is complaining that it's a chipset, a quad-core processor that's almost a year old now yeah. because the Canvas HD has the same chipset. But frankly, outside of our tiny little happy geek universe, to a real world consumer, it is not going to make any difference because in real world performance, it's a butter smooth phone. The screen is fantastic, very responsive, great vivid colors. And like I said, you know, they've put in a very, very good uh, versatile video player in there. You think 18,000 is a good enough price point for this? Because if you look at Canvas HD, what was the deal breaker for that? Was, was the that sub below 15,000, you could get your 5 inch screen, you could get your quad core processor, all of that. So do you think 18,000 is um, stretching it a bit, broadening its canvas? Micro broadening its canvas for sure. I think. Uh, what Micromax is trying to do is they realize that their brand means something yeah. or amounts to something. It has occupied some equity now. can be yeah. translated to a tangible price tag, yeah. so which is what they've tried to do with this. It's a scary territory. 
having said that you get a fantastic uh, flip cover and accessories worth two and a half three thousand rupees bundled in the box so there itself the value of the phone comes to about 15k okay. and the fact that there's a huge volume of pre-ordering which has already happened oh on this phone so maybe they've got it right eleven thousand Unprecedented. How about pouting and unlocking the screen? Oh, no, That's the least you can do no for this way. phone. I'm not pouting. I'm happy to just swipe and unlock. It's great for all. Yeah, so I'll I'll keep air kissing this phone. Having said that, I'm less than enthusiastic about this phone. It's a little heavy for me. Is it the screen me. size? And it is. A, uh, it is a little heavy for me. For me, it's very important. Uh, the one hand test. It fails the one hand test. It really does. I need to use both my hands to negotiate True. it. I am not very sold on their uh, lack of originality when it comes to design. I know you think it's ingenuity and innovations. We're going to move on to Samsung now. Samsung has also introduced two new variants of. The S4, the Galaxy family, that's after this little break.